Hey everyone, I'm Debra from French on the Go. This video is about French pastries. Pest pastries? Pastries? I'm French, okay, so forgive my English. I don't know. Well, you got me. About French delicious cake that are right under my nose. And goddamn, it looks good. Anyway, so I went in a French boulangerie, as we say, and uh, I picked a few different cakes. Anyway, which one I'm gonna start with? Forgive my accent or English, by the way, please. <laughs> I'm trying my best. Let's start with my favorite one ever, the lemon pie. Let's see how this works, because I've never been to the boulangerie where I bought all those, so let's see if they're good. There is not much doubt about it, but let's pretend. Oh, let's, let's taste it, let's, let's have a try. Lemon tarts in French, we call it uh, tarte au citron, which is spelled on it, by the way, citron, which means Anyway, that was for your culture. Here you go, guys. <laughs> oh shit! I know I'm supposed to take just one bite because if I do more, I'll probably get sick. But I. Uh, oh well. <laughs> Damn, it's good. What a nice concept of a video. Seriously, I'm trying French, French pastries. Watch, what? Well, actually, pastry that we can find in France because there's one that is not even French. Uh, next, I think we should try, uh, we should go with one of the most famous and well-known French Patisserie. I'll say it in French because I don't seem to be able to <laughs> pronounce it in English. It's l'éclair. You know the one, the chocolate one. It's the most famous one, l'éclair au chocolat. There's three different flavors, which are chocolate, as I said, uh, coffee, and vanilla. Mmm. <laughs> Look at that. I hope you can see it and that it focuses because this is called crème pâtissière in French. Mm, just google it because I don't know the, um, the English way to say it. <laughs> you you find some in like plenty um plenty of pastries in France and it's just it's a classic uh, okay next one well let's go with another French classic even though like seriously not many people because um, an éclair you'll find a lot of people who eat some my English is terrible I feel like my English is terrible Okay, next, I think we should go with another. Je vais jamais y arriver. Macaron! As you, um, as many people know, it's a famous French uh, cookie. Yeah, I guess we can say it's a cookie type of thing. But this one is way, um, like, according to my experience and what I know not many French people will eat it um, in an everyday life because it is expensive as okay and um, and yeah it's famous but it's actually not what French people would eat the most this is what oh I thought <laughs> I thought I put my arm in the one of the cake anyway this is what French people 
would eat the most uh, compared to Macaron. But I'll give it a try. <laughs> fancy one. I see that this one looks pretty cool, isn't it? It looks cool. I've got no idea what it's made of, but let's have a bite. What's that flavor? Oh, <laughs> shit. Um, I don't know. <laughs> what the? F I have no idea what it is. It's all right. I'm, I'm not a big fan of macaron. It, it is, it is good, but it's too plain to me. Let's go with uh, um, with a colorful one. Maybe it will be fruit. Uh, I see a yellow one, but. We all know lemon is my thing, but let's try, let's try this one. Probably orange, I'd say, probably. Let's give it a bite. Oh. Mm, this one's better. Mm. It's the, um, the best uh, I've ever had so far, I feel like. Okay. Mm. This one was good. Mm. <laughs> I took that, but I don't even need it. My mouth is enough. Hmm. Let's go with the must healing the the most um, well the most delicious cake ever and I'm kind of um, sad to say it but it's not a French one it's a German cake which is la forêt noire as we was, we would say in French Look at that! Okay. Uh, uh. It is so soft. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. I keep on spitting things. Mm. Love it. A thumb. 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 I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't know why, why I, I even want to say those type of thing when I don't even know how to say it. Anyway. Thumb up. Thumb. Thumb. Thumb up. Thumb. <laughs> Thumbs up to this cake. Yes. Alright, let's go with another French. Mm, pastry that is well known at least with French people which is the millefeuille I don't know why it suddenly like like this thing got stuck on my like the back of my tooth teeth teeth and it hurt hurt it hurt oh, hurt a lot for some reason anyway it's good it's messy as I said 
but it's staying good because there is the crème <laughs> crème pâtissière so good so good a painful experience for some reason like that was so random but very good religieuse the religious is this thing. It it comes um, with different flavors as well. Coffee for sure. It's filled with some chocolate, cream, it's delicious. I don't eat that quite often, I should. Pretty good. Mm. Religieuse. Religieuse in French means um, it's a woman who gave her life uh, to God. I don't know why though it's called like that. You can Google it as I didn't do the research. Researched. Research. As I didn't do the research, I should have. <laughs> For some reason, my camera just uh, stopped recording. <laughs> so I was eating uh, with a lot of passion the last um, cake, which is the, um, the strawberry pie. So don't be uh, surprised if it's already like eaten <laughs> because I already quite um, enjoyed it. Anyway. So good, so good. So, oh shit. The, um, the strawberry pie. Simple, uh, as I was saying, it's probably Probably um, something that you find in lots of um, of stores, of uh, bakery stores, um, even in other country. But it's a classic, and it's good, so that's why I bought it. And this was this one is actually a little um, special, special, as there is once again some crème pâtissière, as we mentioned it with the éclair, I don't know if you remember, and yeah, really tasty, I already know. <laughs> mm. So good! There is like some jelly, the crème pâtissière, and the strawberries are, well, Sweet, but also kind of sour. They're, they've got a strong, a strong flavors. I love fruit, so so obviously I love this one as well. <laughs> anyway, I think that's it. I think I can now call my dad to come down so he can enjoy it <laughs> just like I did because he was so like excited about so many cakes. And um, yeah, please uh, subscribe because I'll be traveling a lot uh, next year and I'll be doing a lot of uh, videos. I've already like plenty of ideas for interesting videos and content about food, about culture, about local life, whatever, wherever I'll be going, which is Australia, Japan, China and South Korea so far but I'll keep on traveling so make sure to subscribe so that whenever whenever the fuck I'll be <laughs> doing a, a video you can take a look at it anyway that was Debra uh, and see you in, in my next video <laughs> bye